pronounce you husband and wife, and yes, you can kiss the butt. Sing you give life. I was about one month old, and now something great about Drew and our relationship is that it's always been easy to keep track of each other. One, because we've been going to the same church for our entire lives, and two, because Drew looks the same as he did when we first met. <laughs> On a more serious note, Drew, it's been so amazing to watch you change and grow over the years. From the little kids that would make pizza or wrap the fresh choice after church on Sundays, to the tiny freshman and youth group, to graduating and immediately afterwards uh, starting a full-time job. Seeing changes in you that only God could bring about after becoming saved, to joining the military, and to now becoming a father and a husband. It's been a pleasure and an honor being by your side through all these times. And I'm so proud of you for all that you've done in your short, almost 23 years. And for the character that you and God have built in yourself. Speaking of character, let me tell you a few short stories about Drew's character. <laughs> now Drew's the type of guy that will literally give you the shirt off his back. I know that's a common thing to say in a best man speech, but this time it's actually true. The first is this. When my family was going through a tough time of caring for my dad, there were a few times where my dad fell. And him being a big guy, we could not pick him up on ourselves, by ourselves. I would call Drew, and 20 minutes later, Drew was at my house helping my dad, no matter what Drew was doing. Another time, I really needed Drew's support, and the company he was working for wouldn't give him the time off that he needed to be there for me. So what does Drew do? He quits his job so that he's able to be there. I honor this man because he has given up a lot. First of all, his life to the service, but his life to the other people in Galilee's I honor this man. You are an incredible mother. You are. You are a confident, strong, caring, grace-filled person. I have not seen that in somebody my age. And you and you are believers in my Lord, our Lord, Jesus Christ. I can only thank you. My son and his wife, I honor them for this day Kylie, Drew loves you so much, and I love to hear about how much he adores you and looks up to you and your qualities. You are a wonderful woman, and you and your relationship has made Drew into a better man. Thank you for loving my best friend so much and blessing him by letting him spend a lifetime with you. I hope and pray that your marriage will, for the rest of your lives, be a source of joy, love, laughter, smiles and comfort, safety, openness, a reflection of Christ in his church and everything else that is good.
long who holds our days within his hand what comes apart from his command and what will keep us to the end the love of christ in which we stand oh sing hallelujah our hope springs eternal oh sing hallelujah now and ever we confess christ our hope in life and What truth can calm the troubled soul? God is good, God is good. Where is His grace and goodness known? In our great Redeemer's blood, who holds our faith when fears arise? But stands above the stormy trial who sends the waves that bring us nigh unto the shore the rock of Christ oh sing hallelujah our hope springs eternal oh sing Christ, our hope in life and death. Unto the grave, what will we sing? Christ, he lives, Christ, he lives. And what reward will heaven bring? Everlasting life with him there we will rise to meet the lord then sin and death will be destroyed and we will feast in endless joy when christ is ours forevermore Christ, our hope in life and death. Let's give it up for Kylie.